All right, I know you've seen my other videos about new construction and the communities, but all of those communities are outside of city limits. We are currently going to be looking at one of the few left within city limits on the east side of Tucson. This beautiful gated community is so conveniently located to shopping, there's gorgeous mountain views, and I know I say this in every video, but you're going to want to make sure you stay until the very end because there are amazing incentives that this specific builder is offering. Probably some of the best to date that I've seen. Let's go ahead and take a look inside. Come on in. Today we are at one of the sites for Meritage Homes just off of Houghton. And this community is called Houghton Reserve. Now this is a four bedroom, three and a half bath, just over 2,900 square feet. And right off of the entryway, you have the first two guest bedrooms. Now I love how spaced out these bedrooms are. They're a really good size. They have walk-in closets. And one of the great things about this specific area is that these two bedrooms are adjoined by a Jack and Jill. So you have your double vanities and then you have your water closet with a shower and tub. And then in here, we have the second guest bedroom and another walk-in closet. And I will say this specific um, model home is right off of Houghton Road, which at times can be a little bit noisy, but the rest of the community is further back, so there really isn't any road noise at all. But one thing I wanna mention, because we're right off the road, it's pretty loud when you're outside, but in this house, because of the spray foam insulation that they install, you can't hear anything. It's so great, so nice. I love the wide archway for the entryway. Right off of here, you have your formal dining room. And this is actually one of my favorite rooms in the floor plan. I think it's really elegant, and I know that all open space, um, open floor plans are really popular, but I do like how this is so designated, and it just really keeps the space really nice. We're gonna look over here at the rest of the guest bedrooms, and also, one thing I forgot to mention, besides this being just under 3,000 square feet, it is also a three car tandem garage. So even more extra space for you. Here we have the laundry room and it is standard for all of the laundry rooms to get those top cabinets. Here you have the second guest bathroom and it is just a single vanity and a shower and tub. And over here, we have the third guest bedroom. Now you can obviously use this as a guest bedroom, you can use it as an office space, but these are big bedrooms, especially just for the space and for it being guest bedrooms, they're really, really good space wise. If you're looking to relocate to Tucson or if you already live in the area and you have interest in this neighborhood or any of the new construction communities within the Tucson area, I'd love to help you. My contact information is gonna pop up on the screen and go ahead and screenshot that, save it for later. You can text, call, email me and we can set up a time to get on a one-on-one -on -one call to really go over everything of what you're looking for in a house and neighborhood. I'd love to help you. Now that we saw all of the guest portion of the house, we're gonna take a look in the main living area, but off to the side, you do have a half bath for guests or company or whatever you might have, which is away from the main living area and this wide open living room. It's so beautiful. And then over here, you have a gorgeous designer kitchen. You do have another dining area. I wouldn't call it your full formal because that other room we saw earlier was the formal dining area, but really nice expansive floor plan to where you don't feel like you're on top of one another. You do have a really nice extended island as well. And then this is what they considered their gourmet kitchen where you have your microwave, your built-in oven, dishwasher, your gas stove, which is really great. You have a gorgeous walk-in pantry. And then one of my favorite parts of this house is connecting the kitchen and dining area to the dining room. You have this little butler pantry hallway area, which is great if you're having parties or hosting or anything like that. And then we're gonna make our way across and take a look into the master bedroom. One thing I think that's really great about Meritage is that really also helps buyers save money is all of their homes are done in packages, which means you never go to a design studio. They give you pre-planned packages of the flooring, tile, backsplash, all of that, that really makes it convenient and easy. So 
you get to know what your price is when you're signing on the dotted line at when you sign the contract. So really nice, big, expansive master bedroom. And then you have a gorgeous tiled walk-in shower. And then you do have a double vanity with a makeup counter as well in this master ensuite, which I love. And then over on this side, you have a really big walk-in closet. Great for shoes, clothes, anything like that. You could even fit a little island in here, but really beautiful master ensuite. Now that we're outside, you might hear a little bit of road noise, but again, we're at the model home. This is the furthest corner lot that you're going to get closest to the street. So this isn't like the rest of the subdivision. The rest is way further back, so you do not have any street noise at all. But this landscaping is done strictly for the model homes. Any of the other homes, you're going to be getting dirt lots that they leave it up to you to landscape because again, they wanna make it, for you to make it your own. And another great thing that I love about this community is that if you go east, you have mountain views, and if you go north, you have gorgeous mountain views. So pretty much wherever you are, whether it's in your backyard or if you're walking around the neighborhood, you have a beautiful scenery that you're looking at. All right, before we take a look at the next house, let's see what's around here. But even before that, let's talk builder incentives. I think these are such a huge drawing point for so many of my buyers right now. Um, besides getting a brand new home, you're also getting some amazing interest rates, uh, money back towards you, all appliances included, and all um, window coverings, which can save you hundreds of dollars, if not thousands in the long run. So with Meritage and pretty much all the builders, but specifically with Meritage, their incentives are continuously changing and that can be either weekly, bi-weekly, whenever they run out of it, they're always changing their incentives. So it's great to work with somebody who is getting up-to-date knowledge on what these incentives are, has close relationships with the builders and sales reps so that they're first to know like I am. So currently with Meritage, we're in the third week of September. So they're not going to always be what I'm saying now, but this is currently what these incentives are. Um, there's currently five, I'm gonna read off two, and these are some of the best ones I've seen them to date of what they've offered. So first one is a three to one buy down with a rate lock of 5.25. So initially when you are pre-qualifying, you have to pre-qualify and be able to qualify for that 5.25 interest rate because that is what you are going to be paying um, for the long term of your loan. But what a 3 to one buy down means is that year one, your interest rate is gonna be 2.25. Year two, your interest rate is going to be 3.25. Year three, your interest rate will be 4.25. And then year four through 30 of the loan life, it's going to be 5.25. That's amazing. That saves you hundreds of dollars yearly, annually, whatever you may think. And then on top of that, besides getting all of your appliances included, window coverings, they're also going to give 1% of the loan amount to you to use towards closing costs. So that's less money out of pocket for you. It's a great, great offer. Now, the next one that I've seen, this is the lowest that I've seen the rates be just in general for the past year and a half of what they've offered, is another three to one buy down, but this rate lock is at 4.99%. So that means year one, it's 1.99, yes, you heard that correctly, 1.99% interest rate that you're paying that first year. Year two, it's 2.99. Year three, it's 3.99. And year four through 30, you're locked in at 4.99. Now, because this is such a lower interest rate, they're not offering any money to you at closing, but that's saving you significant amount of money just annually, which is so great. And again, you're still getting those window coverings and all brand new appliances. That's washer, dryer, refrigerator, stove, oven, microwave, dishwasher, everything. So you're getting into a brand new house. You're getting 
crazy low interest rates of what the conventional market cannot offer. And I think it's just a no brainer in general. Now, again, they run out of these quite frequently. It's a first come first serve basis, but they're always changing. This is the lowest I've seen it so far this year, but they're continuously trying to bring out great options for all of their buyers. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the map and what's around the neighborhood. Here we are overlooking all of Tucson. And just to give you an idea of the directionals right here, we are going south, west, north, and east. And you can see right here, this is a little landmark for the Tucson International Airport. And then zooming in, this is more of your central Tucson area. Now we are going to be headed east and we're going to be going to Broadway and Houghton to get to the neighborhood. Now, here is Houghton and Broadway, and this is the Meritage neighborhood of Houghton Reserve, and this is one of the model homes that we were in right in here. So you can see I had mentioned that it was right off of Houghton, but this neighborhood, all of these houses right here are sold and so are these. So all of the houses are going to be in this area here or in this area. So you're pretty well far off of the main area of the main roads. Now, scrolling over not even a quarter of a mile, you are near a Safeway, which is right in through here. You have a McDonald's, a Galaxy Theater. It's a really nice movie theater. Hobbs Sports Grill, there's Mama's Pizza, a lot of other little local restaurants in this area. So you could walk there, ride your bicycle, drive your car, you're less than three minutes away just at this intersection from you know, your amenities. Now, going a little bit more out, if we're heading down Houghton, and then turning on to 22nd, getting to this sub or this area, this is going to be a Target. So you have a Target. You have a Peter Piper Pizza, Panda Express, and this is off of Harrison 22nd, probably about a five minute drive or so from the neighborhood. You have a Ross over here, an Ulta Beauty, and then a Chipotle, Five Guys, a Fry's Fruit Food and Drug. So again, five minutes away, even more amenities from this area. Now, if we're going to, if you're going anywhere from downtown, you're about probably 20 minutes going down Broadway or 22nd. So pretty convenient area to get to downtown, which I will zoom out. Just straight down Broadway, which is this road right here. You are about less than oops, 10 minutes from this area from a Home Depot. Scrolling back out again. So whether you're going to the University of Arizona or if you're going downtown, it's right in this area. So here you have the University of Arizona right here, about a 20 minute drive. And then downtown is right in this area. You can see the big buildings downtown, again, 20 minutes directly down Broadway, which is really nice. So you can still get to central Tucson and be in the area within 20 minutes, but not live anywhere close, which if that's something that you desire, I think that's great. And then we have the, you will be in Tucson Unified School District for the public school. So for high school, that's gonna be Saguaro High School. So headed down Broadway and then turning right here on Camino Seco. You're probably, I wanna say about less than a 10 minute drive to Saguaro High School, and this is the main public high school in the area. And then if you are looking to get to Davis Monthan Air Force Base. So here is again, subdivision right off of Broadway and Houghton. If you're wanting to get to Davis Monthan, you're gonna go directly down Houghton. Okay, scrolling back in. So we are on, headed off of Golf Links and Kolb and right in this area is going to be the davis Monthan air force base so you're probably about a 10 to 15 minute drive from the base which i think is also very convenient so very very close to the mountains and as you saw in this um, the video that there were great mountain views you're very close to parks and also just 
extremely close to amenities, which I think are very, very convenient. Let's take a look at one of their most popular floor plans. This is the Finch. It's a three bedroom, two bath, and again, this is one of their most popular in the neighborhood. Right off of this area, you have the guest bathroom, and then you have two of the guest bedrooms on this side. The first guest bedroom here, and then over on this side, you have the second guest bedroom. And again, I might have mentioned already, but this is just over 2,100 square feet. Three bedroom, two bath. This is designed as the office space, but I do feel like this room might be a little bit bigger than the room next door, but still a great size. And then around the corner, one thing that I really love is they still have these really wide open entry ways like they do in the bigger one. So it still feels really nice and big. We're gonna go over here. Here you have the two car garage entrance, and then you have the washer and dryer laundry room. And again, those top cabinets are always included in all of the homes, which is really great. And then right off of here, you have this flex space, which can be used as an office, it could be used as a gym, whatever you might like, almost a den space. Here, you have a little deep coat closet, and then you have the main living room, kitchen, and dining. And this is actually one of my favorite kitchens. You have a really nice, expansive um, island, you have a deep sink, you have the gourmet kitchen finishes like the oven, refrigerator, and then all of these light pieces and fixtures, these are all custom of what come in these homes, which is really great. They have really nice designer touches. Let's go ahead and take a look in the master bedroom. And for this only being 2,100 square feet, or a little bit over, it feels so big and spacious, especially this bedroom. Really nice big bedroom. This is definitely a king size bed, and then you have really big furniture in here. And then you have a really beautifully tiled master ensuite. Now I've had people ask what this little space is here. They used to have tubs in here, but they got rid of them because they just figured not as many people were using them. You have some um, areas for storage, your walk-in shower, and then a really nice big walk-in closet. I think this is almost the same size as the bigger model as well, which is really great. Those are two of my favorite floor plans that Meritage is currently offering, and the incentives just add that extra cherry on top, plus the amenities and how close everything is in that neighborhood. It just makes it so much more easy and convenient. So if you'd like some more information on the neighborhood and what lots are still available, definitely let me know and I can send that over to you. If this isn't exactly what you're looking for and you would like to explore some more of the new construction builders within the area and different locations, I can also help you with that. You can reach out to me through text, phone call, email, whatever's easiest for you, especially my out-of-state clients. I'd love to help you. We can set up a time to get on a one-on-one -on -one call and make it super easy. I'll see you in the next video.